Hi, my name is Ronan Kennedy and I'm a career coach and business mentor. You might need to sell a project that you've worked on or to sell your performance on a project at some stage. It could be in a performance review, it could be in a interview, or it could be around a meeting with clients. So a couple of ways you can think about this is uh, what were the key factors that led to success? What did you do to have an impact on that success? In other words, why did it go well? So that's the first point. The second point is, what were the key challenges that you encountered? What were the key struggles? So what did you have to grapple with to overcome? Uh, what did you have to deal with and how did you deal with it? So it's really important again to show that struggle so that people know how big an effort you put in to actually get the ultimate uh, achievement or the ultimate objective. The next one is, what was a key learning that you took away from this project? So it could be that, stakeholders are really important it, like it's crucial to get their buy-in or it could be to plan uh, as well as possible at the start or it could be to align your vision with uh, your vision for the plan and the stakeholders at the very start to make sure everyone's on the same page or it could be something else like creating a contingency plan so that um, even if something goes wrong you're prepared for it so what was the key learning for you uh, on this project that you will take to the next project this will show good uh, reflection on your behalf and finally what was the return on investment of the project so all the energy and the time and the resources and the technology that's invested in doing this project well what was the ultimate return on investment so again what did you save time did you save money or make money uh, did you solve a big problem and were people happy with that ultimate result, okay? So it's really good to be very clear on that return on investment piece because that's obviously what a lot of people will look at as the ultimate objective. And if you can articulate that by using metrics, that's gonna come across really strongly as well. So I hope that gives you some food for thought uh, to think about what was the uh, challenge, what were the key success factors, what was the learning, and what was the return on investment. Thanks for watching.